This is a certified hood classic. Yo, I never knew about this game. You're before. wasting time. Get out of here. Nigga, shut the fuck up. You don't see me talking? They really pushed you through quick, didn't they? Six years on patrol before I got this desk. You were here in five minutes. What do you want me to say? I interrupt them. I didn't ask for any favors. What's wrong with you? Just the cop who solved the big case. I'm not a loss. They know my name in the streets. You know this place? Sure. Near the old gas works and signal depot in the warehouse district. I'll direct. Anyway, like I was saying before I was really interrupted, L.A. Noor? Noor? This is a good fucking game, yo. This is a good fucking game. I'm, yo, I'm about to be the, I'm about to be the black Sherlock Holmes when it comes to this shit. I'm telling you. I'm telling, watch me cook. The thirst of a king can be quenched for just a nickel with Cola King. You can shut, you can shut that off. Any in the vicinity is so. here. This shit loud as hell though, hold on. Hey, you may gotta cut the music down. Effects, dialogue, just a tad bit. Music, shut the music off. Copyright, YouTube gotta get that copyright fixed. You know they always doing that bullshit with that copyright. Tell me a little about yourself, Phelps. Are we friends now, Picasso? We have to work together, don't be so touchy. I grew up in San Francisco. My father was in shipping. I went to college at Stanford. Did two years ROTC before Marine OCS at Camp Elliott. What a bitch. Shipped out in early 45 as a first lieutenant and fought in the Okinawa campaign. I was wounded, shipped back home. Did a year on the beat. Now I'm here. So you won the Silver Star. I don't want to talk about it. Now let me get this straight. You single-handedly killed 40 Japs on this hill in Okinawa. No. You were up there all night, draped in the flag, knife between your teeth, gun at the ready. You finished? The Emperor Hirohito himself leading the charge against you. I did my part, Bukowski. What did you do? I kept the streets of L.A. safe for the people. Yeah, I... yeah. Now I get it. Unfit for service. Now fuck you, Phelps. I earned a bravery citation during the Zuda riot. <laughs> Sounds like you had it rough. I did my job. No one is saying you didn't. I did six years as a patrolman. That's the third time you've told me. Yeah, nigga, it's all about me. I don't give a fuck what you did, nigga. It's all about my story. What the fuck you talking about? You ain't putting in the pain I'm putting in. That you, Bukowski? Go on through. Parking lot straight ahead. These nosy ass niggas. I need to get back to work, officer. The detectives are here now. You repeat to them what you told me. I did the right thing by calling this in. I'm just a working stick. Just give them your story and you'll be all right. No, don't trust them niggas. This is your first case, Phelps. It's okay to admit it if you're stumped. If you don't know what to do next, just come talk to me and we'll see what we can figure out. Thanks, Stefan. I don't need you, nigga. You're okay. What the fuck? Need you, nigga. I should probably move my cam. Hold on, let me move my cam real quick. Yeah, this nigga talking like I need him. I don't need you, nigga. I know what the fuck. I know how to cook, nigga. I'm Officer Hart. Phelps, traffic. What have you got? Abandoned car, probably stolen. The solid citizen is Nate Wilkie. He called it in. What gives with the corner? There's blood all over the interior. Someone's copped a full Broderick, but no stiff as yet. We have an owner for the car? The car is registered to an Adrian Black, just north of Bunker Hill. All right, we'll take a look around. I'll keep Mr. Wilkie talking, but don't make him wait too long. He's the restless type. Hey. 
Let me talk to my brother. Nice day for it. How long are you gonna keep me here, sir? Until I feel like it. Now I better get, get your, back to work, Shut your sir. black ass up. Morgan picked up a live pig yesterday? The fuck? Okay. Any nope. blood on that motherfucker? See the pipe? What, what's what's with the pipe? I doubt it. Nah. Alright, let me look. Let me look. Let me look. Doc, Detective Phelps, what have we got? A lot of blood for a blunt force injury. The victim must be in a very bad way. Any sign of the guy? Not unless he's in the trunk of the car. I just checked the trunk. Look, I talk to this nigga. Oh. Damn. A brand name might give us something to go on. Okay. Nigga ain't got no gloves? You touching that shit with your bare hands? Ew, nigga. I guess. Nigga ain't get my ain't get my man some gloves. I have another five cases to get to this morning, detective. Oh, fuck. I'm just passing all types of evidence. Hold on, what's this? Your times, I guess. Damn. Alright. These must be his glasses. These are glasses. Talk to the black nigga? Where he at? Yeah, let me talk to this nigga, yo. Sir, I'm Detective Phelps. Name's Nate Wilkie. You found the vehicle? Sure. Saw it just sitting there. Strange place to be parking your car. Figured I'd better take a look. And then I saw all the blood. Mm. So I called the police. Purpose at the scene, knowledge of Adrian Black. Bloodstained pipe fan. What should I hit him with? I can't say purpose at this. I can't say purpose at the scene because the nigga worked there. This is his job. Knowledge of Adrian Black. Bloodstained on the pipe fan. Mm, let's go with this. We found a steel pipe with blood on it near the car. Do you know anything about it, Mr. Wilkie? No, sir. I went straight for the law when I saw the car was full of blood. Mm. Oh yeah, I gotta move my camera. I should be able to tell if this nigga lying or not, right? Mm. Which I think. As a fellow African American myself, niggas be lying. <laughs> I'm accusing this nigga. Tell me the truth. 
You hit the driver with the pipe. Oh, well, I mean, you can't prove I touched that pipe. I think you should take that gun off, and I'll teach you a lesson in some manner. Hold on, nigga. Don't get your ass whooped out here, nigga. Okay. Abandoned vehicle, blood splashes, receipt, receipt for the life of bloody pipe. All right, he got sensitive about the pipe, so. You want to arrest me now, or can I go back to work? Purpose at Mind the if I ask what you were doing out here? The nigga worked Well, there. I worked for the railway. I was on my way out to the switch and reckoned I'd take a shortcut. Nah, 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 nah. He lying. You're holding out on me. Spill it. I'm telling you all I know. I already wasted hours getting involved in this thing. Nigga, you ain't doing nothing besides eating honey buns and smoking Newports. You gonna answer these motherfucking questions, nigga. Do you know Adrian Black, Mr. Wilkie? No, sir. That ain't a name I'm familiar with. You wanna keep playing with me? Keep playing with me. I know when your black... Look at that nigga face. That black... That, that motherfucker's lying. I'm gonna go good cop, though. You ever seen the car before? Funny enough, I did. A couple of nights ago, it was over there in the parking lot. I know most of the cars are parked here regular, so it kind of stood out. Mm. Thank you for your patience, Mr. Wilkie. If you don't mind waiting a little longer, I'm sure we'll have more questions once we've had a look around. I gotta keep moving my fucking camera around, man. Fuck. Because the true or false questions... Let me move it on this side, man. Fuck it. Alright. What, what else clues can I find? Oh, what's this? Some vibrator over here. Nah. I already checked that out. Leaving the scene, I don't want to do that. What's over here? Something vibrating over here. There we go. What's this? Doesn't look like anything. Uh oh, he's <laughs> wasting my fucking time. I gotta talk to this Negro again. Advice? Check the whole area, detective. Assume everything's a potential lead. He just standing there. He ain't no help. Oh wait. Oh wait, 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 wait. Victim looks to have lost a lot of blood. I would have told you that, nigga. That ain't no big clue. I already know that. That's his wallet. I already know that. Man, I don't want to go too far. What's this? What's this? What's this? Look at all these nosy niggas over here. Nah, that's the pipe that I picked up with the blood on it. Check that. Ain't nothing in the ain't nothing in the car I could look at? Nothing? I told you all I can. I gotta go back to work or I'll lose my job. Nigga, you ain't doing shit anyway besides smoking Newports and backwards, nigga. You gonna stay your black ass over here. You leave when I tell you to leave, boy. Oh, wait, what's this? What the fuck is this?
What's that brown bag, man? Check this nigga wild already. Yeah, he 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 fat with a wife. Yeah, I, I checked that already. I checked that already. What's this? Okay. Thirty-two years old, married. Sounds like an average guy. What was he doing out here? Getting pussy. These are his glasses. These are his glasses. That's it. There's something over here that I'm missing. Oh, okay. Stenzel glasses. Home repaired by the look of it. Okay, but that's not really, you feel me? The type of glasses he got, what the fuck is that going to do? I want to see what this brown, this black is. Let me question his black ass. The wallet by the car. Was there anything in it when you arrived? You accusing me of something, mister? Yeah, nigga. Look at his fucking face. Yeah, this nigga's lying. Tell the truth, Mr. Wilkie. You rifled the wallet. My money is my money. You can't prove I touched that wallet. He lying, yo. Alright, what about the glasses, nigga? Man does the right thing, and the police try to turn him into a criminal. Man. Don't leave town, Mr. Wilkie. We'll get in touch with your employer if we need anything more from you. I'll let him know why I missed half my shift today. Your boy should learn some gratitude. Yeah, your black ass probably wasn't even gonna come to work anyway. We're done here. We'll head over there now. Your black ass wasn't trying to go to work anyway. You wasn't you wasn't doing shit. Acting like you busy, nigga. You ain't busy. I'm a good ass detective though. <laughs> oh shit. Now that was horrible. List of agents. Okay, we got an address. 620 Bunker Hill Avenue. You know where that is? Behind Bunker Hill. A couple blocks north of Central Station. Oh. So, what do we tell the wife? We play it by the book. There's no stiff yet, so let's see how it plays out. Could be a car theft gone wrong. Make Black drive somewhere lonely, then give him a tap. But why leave the car? Yeah, that don't make no sense. Well, obviously, someone got a little heavy hand. It's the wrong way around. Well, how so, genius? Where is Adrian? Oh. If you've gone to all the trouble to steal the car and it goes wrong, you leave the body behind, not the car. Well, you got something there, Phelps. I know I got something. Doesn't add up. Watch hey, it! My bad, my bad. You read about the guy on the crossing yesterday? No, what happened? Over on Lincoln Avenue. This guy's driving along and his oil light comes on. He stops the car and gets out. <laughs> he pops the hood and... He's on a rail crossing. <laughs> oh, you got it. He's got his head under there checking the oil, and the Southern Pacific Freight slams into his car doing 90 miles an hour. The car came to a rest more than Why a mile down so the long? track. 
What a pointless reason. You'll get plenty of blood and guts and mindless stupidity when you're traveling, folks. And who needs a Second Amendment when we'll give a goddamn fool the license to get behind the wheel of an automobile? If it's a kidnapping, why leave the victim's ID? If it's a murder, why leave the car? The evidence doesn't add up. Free lesson, Phelps. Evidence will only get you so far. You ask me? Watch what you're doing! Shut the fuck up. What I wouldn't give to have your powers of intuition, Bukowski. Don't worry, kid. Keep watching the master and you'll get there one day. Finally at this broad house. Long ass fucking drive, man. How you speed? You can't speed. Uh, yeah, Alright, I'm gonna say you can't fucking. You were walking slow as hell. Ain't got no hops. It's a gorgeous house. Let's go introduce ourselves. You talk to her, Phelps. I'm no good at this shoulder to cry on stuff. Just a minute. She got a fat ass. LAPD, Mrs. Black. May we come in? We have some bad news, and we'd rather discuss this in private. I'm Margaret Black. Oh, we can discuss this in the living room. Please come in. Your husband drives a blue Lincoln, Mrs. Black? That's correct. The car has been found abandoned, and I'm afraid there are signs of foul play. Mm. I knew something was wrong when he didn't come home. We believe your husband may be injured. We found a pipe on the scene with blood on it. Oh, no! My poor Adrian! Does the name Instaheat mean anything to you, ma'am? Yes, it does. We've just had a new water heater installed. Mm. Whereabouts, Mrs. Black? Just outside the kitchen window, at the side of the house. I'd like you to try and stay calm and remember everything that you can about last night. My partner and I are going to take a look around. When you're ready, we're going to have some more questions for you. Is that okay? Of course, officer. Anything to help secure my husband's safety. That nigga dead. <laughs> Straight like that. Well, let's check the place out. Come on. What the fuck? That nigga dead. All that blood that was on that car, that nigga's gone. Have a good look around. There's got to be something in here to go on. All right, so we're about to run through this lady whole house. Oh, what's this? What, what the fuck is that? This was only recently installed. Not two days ago. Mm. Maybe it's time we took a look around outside. Ain't got no cigarettes in this bitch. Fuck it. She got a nice garden though. I'll I give her that. Oh, what's, what's, what's this? Probably nothing. Yeah. No use leaving the thing half finished. This ain't my job. Come on, man. I can't be right. This nigga think he bobbed the builder. We we ain't come here for this, man. What the fuck is this?
We did not come here for this, man. No, that won't work. This nigga think he bobs so the building. The pipe missing from Mr. Black's heater is the same one that killed him. Huh. Seems like the assailant is a little closer to home. So now we'll uh, go back inside. Is there anything else I, I need to look at? What about the backyard? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, that shit ain't nothing. Where's she at? I already checked that out. To my Aiden. To my Adrian. Okay. This thing gets more and more interesting. Love sick and lonely without you. Hurry back, my darling. Okay. That's just, that's normal though. Right? Oh yeah, that I'm, this must be Adrian. That's for his glasses, yeah. Stenzel. So the glasses are a match. Yep. What else is in here? That ain't nothing. Cavanaugh's? So who brought this home? Nigga really think he's Sherlock Holmes or something. Get the fuck out of here, nigga. What's this? She had an affair? Separate bedrooms, separate pictures. What gives here? Check the back like you did. Check the back like how you did. Yeah. Nah, you can't. She ain't getting no dick. It's time for me to question her. Where's she at? Alright. Let's start with the location. Did your husband tell you where he was going last night? All he said was he was going to meet Frank for a drink. Okay. I believe her. So nothing out of the usual then? Well, he came home early from work. He never comes home early. And he went out early too. He normally never leaves for the bar till about seven. Okay. What bar did he go to? Another buy from Mrs. Black, photograph of her sign of clothes. Uh, I'll talk about the Was glasses. Was your husband wearing his glasses when he left here yesterday? Yes, he just bought a new pair. Let me use my let me use my let me use my um my Sherlock Holmes thoughts. She's telling the truth. Go on. I kept telling him to throw those old ones away. He tried to repair them with tape. They looked terrible. She telling the truth. Tell us about the photo of Adrian in the bedroom. What is there to tell? It's from his most recent business trip to Seattle. She lying. There's plenty to tell. You just won't tell it. You're lying about the photograph, Mrs. Black. You're incredibly rude and insensitive. But I guess you know that. I told you what I know about the picture. She lying. She know damn well he was getting some pussy on that business trip. Whatever. What about... Yeah. 
you're wrong. I presume it's too much to expect an apology. Bitch. I think you should come clean with us, Mrs. Black. Your husband is missing, and after our search, I'm willing to call the circumstances suspicious. Yeah. Can you account for your movements last night? Yeah. You're not accusing me, are you? Yeah. Oh, what an awful thing to say. I was here all night, of course, waiting for Adrian to come home. Were you? I don't believe this bitch. Something not right. Y'all got separate beds. You couldn't have been wait. You know what? You couldn't have been waiting. Y'all got separate beds. Y'all was. You was not waiting for that nigga to come home. Let me use my intuition. Let me use my. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. I don't believe this hoe. Let me check my notes. Fuck it. Is there anyone who can vouch for that? Yeah, I like that answer. Well, no. I, I, I was here alone. I cooked Adrian's dinner and waited. But he never came home. We found a receipt in the trunk of your husband's car for a live pig. This receipt was made out to an F. Morgan. A pig? Adrian runs a tool business. That would be Frank Morgan. God knows what he's up to. I want to know more about that nigga Frank. It's the second time I'm hearing his name. You want to tell me about that nigga Frank? I believe her, though. What makes you say that about Morgan, ma'am? He's the foreman at my husband's plant. A very shady character. I've told Adrian he needs to keep his distance from the staff. They're always out drinking together. What bar? this hold up now mm. lie down make yourself comfortable the fuck so your friend of Courtney's yes doctor he seems very concerned about you I have these visions these blinding visions. I can't get them out of my head. My skull, it, it feels like it's in a vice. I'm going to give you something to calm your nerves. Are you doing heroin? I want to take you on a journey. A journey back. I want you to remember the good things about your past. Occasions that made you laugh. Times that made you smile. What a weirdo. What else is on the table? I already saw that though. Maybe Adrian was a patron. R and I should have an address. That ain't really that ain't really much though. Find find a phone to call for an address. Bitch, where your phone at? Oh here it is. Operator, message for KGPL. Putting you through now. Phelps, badge twelve forty seven. I need an address on a Kavanaugh's bar. Certainly, Detective. One moment. Damn, that's Kavanaugh's how they had to do it back bar, in the day? Corner of Aliso and Hewitt. South side of Union Station. Thank you. 
All right, so we're going to the bar. We out. You coming with me? Nah, I want to go to that bar. Go to that bar. There's something about that bar. Any in the vicinity, see the man at 211 just occurred. Third Neal Street. Well, I'm busy. Further, unit to handle code three I'm busy. I'm busy. I ain't responding to that shit. No, you don't. You sure the fuck don't. Great. Looking for someone, but you're real nice. You gotta talk. I mean, you know Frank you. Morgan? Sure. Frank's your regular. He's a loner in the back. Sam's taking me out to Palm Springs for the weekend. I don't give a fuck where Sam is taking you. This is him right here? Frank Morgan? Who's asking? Where is he? That cherry pie was oh, the Cole Felt, LAPD. I understand you're a friend of Adrian Black. Yeah, I know. Are you aware that he's missing? No, I hadn't heard that. Tough break. He's a dick. That's, this is supposed to be your man's. We found Black's car abandoned in a freight depot, <clears throat> covered in blood. You know anything about that, Morgan? Hell no. I, I, I'm sorry to hear that. I like Adrian. He, He's a good no, boss. Please, don't tell me you actually believe this jerk-off, Phelps. Fuck no, I don't. Fuck that nigga, I don't believe I think you were in on it, Morgan. You drove down there, and you let Black have it. Ooh, I'm a bad boy. That the best you got? I'm gonna show you what I got, nigga. When did you last see Adrian? Hell, I don't know. Uh, I had plenty to drink last night. Things are a little sketchy. This nigga is lying. You're lying, Morgan. What happened to Adrian? I have ten guys who say I was here the whole night. You think you can prove I was there? You know why? You know how I know your black ass was there? Receipt, nigga. You signed your name and left it on the slaughterhouse receipt, Frank. We couldn't have you colder if we found you curled up in the back seat. Yeah, yeah. All right, all right. Yeah. I helped him. He wanted it to look like his car got hijacked. He's fallen for some dame up in Seattle, and now he's got to go start a new life with her. Goddamn fool. Where exactly is Black holed up? Where the fuck he at? No idea. I think he took off for Seattle. You want me to bitch slap you, huh? I'm tired of your shtick, Morgan. Spill it! Or we take you out in the alley and we knock it out of you! Yeah! He's holed up at my place. He's waiting for some money to come through before he blows town. An address? It's an apartment house at the corner of Temple and Figueroa. Apartment number two. I think that's all. Thanks for your help, Morgan. We appreciate it. That's hey, I'm just glad I could help. I love cops. Cuff him, let him go. It's up to you, Phelps. There's no way I'm writing this idiot up. Cuff that nigga. Fuck that nigga. Cuff his white ass. You got Morgan's address? Let's get over to his apartment. So he, you trying to say he staged a murder or some shit? For what? No, 
Oh, we going to that nigga's apartment. I've met some pretty good liars in my time. People who sound convincing because they actually believe their own bullshit. <laughs> the type is clever. Hard to catch out. Frank Morgan is not one of those people. No, he is not. I don't know, I just felt like I, 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 I can lock him up. Why not? Man? It'll be alright. 11K, go ahead. Message from Technical Services. What's down in the oh. abandoned Lincoln at the PE Freight Depot is not human. Repeat, not human. Compositional analysis reveals swine as the most likely match. Roger, KGPL. It's time to reel this guy in, Phelps. Why would you want to fake your own death, though? I don't understand. Probably that wife. Get your ass in there. Check the place out. I ain't got no strap. Wait, 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 wait. Nigga, if you don't get your get your ass up. You wanna sit down again, nigga. Get up, nigga. Fuck it. It says apartment number two, right? Am I going the right way? Hold on, let me move on. This 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 got too much camera movement going on. Let me move my shit right here. I gotta figure out how I want my camera. Where's this nigga apartment door at? Nah, that ain't his shit. I think I went too far. His, his shit ain't up here. His shit down here. Help you, gentlemen? LAPD detectives, Mr. Black. You're under arrest. Look, I'm really sorry about nah, this. Nah, nigga, put your hands on I never your tried back. to hurt anyone. I just needed to get away from LA. Why? I won't put up a struggle. Just. Let me get my things. You I knew it! That nigga. Phelps, go after him. I'll try and head him off in the car. Remember, the gun is the last resort. I'm, not, I'm shooting that nigga. There's no point running, Adrian. Get your ass over here. Mr. Black, get back here right now. Can I sh shoot this nigga? Adrian. Where he at? It's over, Adrian. Why not just come clean with her, Black? Why the melodrama? I thought it would be easier. No, it just got a whole lot harder. Adrian Black, you're under arrest for conspiracy and fraud. We'll see what the DA has to say about wasting police resources on a wild goose chase like this. You're gonna lose your wife? Lose your job and probably end up in the big house. I hope she was worth it, Adrian. Well, he, is he getting extorted? Like, what was the fucking point? That turned out to be quite some case, huh? Adrian, what an idiot. You got an arrest and a clearance in your first case and in fine style, too. Well done, detective. Efficient investigation technique, good public presence. You keep that up and you... Learn from Bukowski here, and you could go a long way in this department. No, all in the day's work. You feel me? All in the day's work. But that's what happens when you're the black Sherlock Holmes. I get shit done, nigga. Seven out of 12 questions correct? That's not bad. 
That's not bad. I should have been a detective. The fuck am I doing with my life? All right, that'll do it here. Damn, this was a good long ass fucking video. Leave a like if you enjoy. Let me know if I should continue this series. This game is, yo, this shit. <laughs> I'm going to be out of pocket with this game. But leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm out.